Happy Friday and welcome to Fox 17 Unfiltered. I'm Max Goldwasser. Basically, as we're speaking right now, the puck is dropping on center ice inside Van Andel Arena behind us because the Grand Rapids Griffin season is officially underway. But before the players face off against the San Diego goals, a couple of them had to face some tough questions from me earlier this week. Okay, I'm going to try to stand up on my skates as best as I can for this, but in honor of uh, the season starting for the Grand Rapids Griffins, thought it would be fun for West Michigan to get to know their players a little bit better. So on my left, I have Jonathan Bergrant, plays wing, yep. uh, second year in the AHL, second year with the Griffins. Yep. Okay. On my right, Matt Luff, seventh year in the AHL, first year with the Griffins. Yep. Griffin, welcome to Grand Rapids, Thank by you. the way. Uh, gentlemen, I'm just going to rally off some, some quick fire questions. And you're going to give me some answers. Sound easy enough? Yeah, yeah. All right, let's do it. What is one thing you cannot live without on a game day? Oh, yeah, the nap. I'm game a big day nap, nap guy. Oh, yeah. One how, to three. How long are we talking? One to three, one to three thirty. The two hour nap. Oh, easily. That's quite the power snooze. Oh, right oh yeah. Full on black open <laughs> lines. Not seeing an inch of daylight until three. Surprised you even wake up for the game at that point. A couple alarms. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? Yeah, I'm the same. Same? Yeah, big nap guy. Okay, good. That's very <laughs> important. How many teeth? Have you lost playing the game of hockey, if at all? No, nothing. None for I'm you? Zero. Wow. I feel like that's rare territory. For it is. Players. I've actually wanted to lose a few, but We can happened. make that work. <laughs> that's, I've honestly offered guys like 100 bucks and all. Like never, <laughs> never gone through. We'll do that off camera. Yeah. Hockey players are known to be tough guys, but what would be something that people out there might be surprised to know that brings out your softer side? Uh, I think I'm pretty soft guy. Oh, OK. Yeah. You will never see me in fight, I think. Okay. Yeah. Maybe if someone take laugh, I'll back him up. Well, so. Good, good, good. Yeah. I, got you, I got your back. Yeah, I usually go for one a year. <laughs> <laughs> one a year is good. Be honest. One fight and then hopefully one tooth a year. Now. Yeah, that'd be kind of nice. Yeah. What would you be doing if you weren't playing professional hockey? Uh, golf. Okay. All I do in the summer. It sounds like that's what a lot of you guys play anyway. So. Yeah, seven days a week on the course. Okay. Is the skills translate over to the, to the golf course? I'm not a bad golfer. Okay. Having my days. Yeah. Yeah. What about you? I think uh, soccer player. Soccer player. Yeah. I can see it. Okay. Yeah. I can see it. Yeah. A little good feet, good feet work here. It's oh, wow. <laughs> not a bad comparison. No. Last meal on earth. You get an appetizer, an entree, and a dessert. Okay. You're rolling with what? I'm so going you. Caesar salad to start. <laughs> Healthy boy. And then it's so good. Just, <laughs> and then it's gotta be some kind of sushi for sure. That was the main. Okay. Maybe like a shrimp and pearl roll in there, or some sashimi. That's good stuff. And then to finish it, anything with uh, like maybe an apple crumble or something. Ooh. Yeah. And then good just, for this time of year yeah. too. Okay. You? Oh, I'm not a health fan. That's him. No, I'm I go on your for side. Uh, spicy shrimp. Okay. Spicer, really okay. good. I th maybe take a burger, like a bit of love cheese and. Uh huh. Taking a burger. I'm on this side. Oh, oh I Swedish burgers. Oh, I'm, ba I'm baking cheeseburger too, yeah. so I'm right there with you. With uh, fr French fries and some good uh, yes. garlic dip. Yeah, you need the garlic oil. Yeah, oh, yeah. Nice. yeah, that's nice. And for uh, dessert, maybe some uh, good cake. Uh, in Sweden, we have uh, one called Princess Torta. Princess Torta? Yeah. Okay. So good. So, I think I take that. I think I've seen the soft side of things yeah. come out right there. <laughs> okay, last question for you guys. If you could, if you could take one celebrity on a date, who would it be? Where would you go? One celebrity? Yeah. Um, Madison Beer. Hundred <laughs> percent. Yeah, we, we're, I'm gonna post this. You don't on... know who Madison Beer is? Whoa. Oh man. <laughs> He'll uh, show you at some. Point. I'll show you. Uh, Madison I'm gonna post Beer. this on TikTok at some point, oh. so maybe she'll see it. Yeah, maybe she will. Hopefully, Madison Beer. Madison Matt Love. Beer. If you want to date in meet. Grand Rapids, I think I got it. Oh, the girl. <laughs> yeah, the girl. Oh. Yeah. I'm bad at English. No, okay. And you? Uh, poof. I'm. I maybe take some soccer player, Slatan Ibrahimovic. Okay. You know him. Zlatan? Yeah. You're going to take Zlatan on yeah. today? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you took a guy. Yeah, I took a girl. Took a <laughs> okay. All right, gentlemen. Thank you so much for that. We got to know you as people. Let's get to know you as players a little bit, okay? Let's Trick shot it. competition. You ready? Yep. All right, let's do it. Fergie, you went with the guy who went to Madison <laughs> That's Beer. That's hilarious. <laughs> was I was automatic. If I was take a girl, my girlfriend would be pissed. Oh, yeah. Hey. Man, you're so cool, Fergie. Oh. Okay. Okay. Hey. No oh, way. Fergie. Let's go. Where do you want it? Oh, okay, skate, hard pass. Hard pass? Skate. Yeah. <laughs> if I can stand up. Just, ow. But on my skate. On your skate? 
but other one. Bro, I'm not good at this. <laughs> this one. my best. Oh! Oh, oh you had it, Fergie. That Bergie. was it! Come on. Fergie, that was it. You're not going to get any better than that from me. Yes, oh, yeah, that's Fergie. It. Yes, Fergie. Let's go! Yes, Fergie. I got to do it on the other side then. Yeah, yeah. Righty lights. Oh! Oh! I, I blew Yo, it. Egg. Full panic. Go try not to play. Oh! Hey, I'm, I'm putting my arms on you for this part because things are not going well. But gentlemen, thank you so much for having us out here, showing us how the pros really do it, and good luck this season. Awesome. Thank you. Thanks Go Griffins. Go Griffins. Go Griffins. So like we said tonight, it's the season opener for the Grand Rapids Griffins. Puck dropped just moments ago at 7 o'clock. It's the first matchup in a two-game home series against the San Diego Goals. The next one is at seven o'clock tomorrow as well. The Griffins will be back on the ice at Van Andel next Wednesday as well, uh, but this time against the Milwaukee Admirals. Van Andel Arena is one of the best venues in the entire AHL. That's not just coming from us. No, that's according to the National Bobblehead Hall of Fame and Museum in Milwaukee. And today, that museum unveiled 32 vintage bobbleheads, one for each team in the league. So here's the one for the Griffins. It's a pretty cool piece for any collectors or Griffins fans. You can order them right now as well. They're $30 each plus shipping, and the museum will send them out in November. If you want to get the whole set, all 32, that would cost you about 900 bucks. You can place your order right now on bobbleheadhall.com. And the museum also sells Red Wings bobbleheads. This one right here is Hockey Hall of Famer Terry Sawchuk, who was a goalie who signed with the Red Wings all the way back in the 40s. And speaking of Detroit, yeah, that team is kicking off its season tonight as well, starting a new year with a new coach, Derek Lalonde, and some fresh talent too, hoping for a much better season than the last one. Uh, the game started at 7 as well at Little Caesars Arena. They are playing the Montreal Canadiens.